Hey guys, my name's Jamin. Thanks so much for visiting my channel. In this video, I have a Lenovo IdeaPad 3, the 15 inch version. I'm gonna show you how to open it up, get inside, access your Wi-Fi card. So first thing guys, power down your computer the correct way, make sure it's off and unplugged from your charger. We're then gonna flip your computer over to access your bottom case screws. Now you have these four screws along the bottom edge here, these three along the middle, and these three along the top. Once you get those screws out, you're going to take your small, flat, preferably plastic pry tool. I say plastic because metal tends to scratch your cases much more than plastic ones. So take your small, flat, plastic pry tool and go across this seam all the way around to gently but firmly pry up your bottom case from the rest of your computer. Be careful not to put your pry tool too far in. You could damage things inside the computer. Just keep it on the edge and go nice and slow. If you get stuck in a spot, stop and continue in the other direction. Once you get your bottom case off, this is what you're looking at for the inside of your computer. Now, as a side note, guys, to your computer repair project, whenever I'm working on a computer in my shop, I have it sitting on an anti-static mat. Either a mat or an anti-static bracelet are great ideas to help you limit the chances of damaging anything in your computer when working on them. If you need help with any tools or supplies for your computer repair, there'll be a link above, also below in the description. It'll be a list of things that I use in my shop. So here's your battery right here on the bottom right corner. If you want to remove it, you have these three screws here. You have two on the left, one on the right, and then the battery plugs into the motherboard right there. Because there's not a lot of slack in this line, I had to remove the battery and then use it to pull out of that port there. Even though I always say to not pull from the wires, if you can help it, there's really no other way to pull that out. It's, it's really kind of hard. So I had to pull it out from the wires. Now that the battery has been removed or at least unplugged, it's safe to proceed deeper into the computer. Your Wi-Fi card is right here to the right of your fan, right above your solid state drive. As a side note guys, if you're looking for a replacement Wi-Fi card or any replacement parts for this model computer, I'll have a list of them in the same link below in the description that I mentioned earlier that has all the tools. It'll have all the replacement parts and upgrade parts as well. So that'll include your Wi-Fi card, RAM, battery, solid state drive, any, any replacement parts for the IdeaPad 3 15 inch version. So to get your Wi-Fi card out, it's plugged into this port right here and it's held down by a single screw right there. So once you undo that screw, you can pull this Wi-Fi card out and, and you'll have released it from the port. And these antenna wire here, those just snap right off. They're not plugs, they're just snaps. So you pull those right up and out of the computer and, it, and it'll snap off of that Wi-Fi card. So fairly easy operation to, to access that. So that's the video guys, I hope it was helpful. If you have any questions, check out the FAQs below in the description, it could save you some time getting an answer. If you do need to leave me a question or comment, please do, I do try to get to those a couple times a day at least. To support the channel, please remember to like and share, subscribe if you enjoy this type of DIY tutorials, and for those of you that wanna support the channel a little further, you can always leave a small donation, and there's a couple ways to do that. First, right below the video to the right hand side, you'll see the super thanks button. You can click on that. You can select a tip amount here. Second way, you can use your cash app. Find me at dollar sign PC helper. You can leave a dollar amount and you can even leave a little note. So thank you so much for watching guys and I look forward to seeing you on my next video.